God had tackled the taste buds of your heart. That's right. Yeah. That's right. That's what God, hallelujah, glory. That's hallelujah. what God will do. Oh, yes. He had tackled your, the taste buds of your heart. Oh, yes. He declared in his word, choose ye this day, day. whom you're going to serve. That's right. This day. If God be God, serve, serve him. him. Serve him. If Satan be God, serve him. You choose. Now therefore fear the Lord. Do you hear this? In the book of Joshua chapter 24 and verse 14. Now therefore. Fear the Lord. Fear God. And serve him. Fear God. Fear the Lord. Glory to God. That's it. That's the thing that's missing among the world, the fear of God. That's right. Do you hear this? Now therefore fear the Lord. Give chapter and verse again, Williams. Joshua chapter 24 and we're at verse 14. Now. Now therefore fear the Lord. God wants us to respond right now. Now. That's right. Now. Do you hear me? Now God wants us to respond right now. Now. That's right. That's right. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I want you young people to really listen good. That's right. Because you're scared to give up things. Yeah. Especially you love it. Oh, yes. When you love it, you're scared. Amen. Amen. But God, I, after that, I want the scripture how he was said in variance. Yes. I want to show you what God would do with his word. That's right. And you judge yourself and see are you ready for it. That's right. Listen at this. Joshua chapter 24 and verse 14. What is it? Now, therefore, fear the Lord. Fear the Lord. And serve him. Serve them. And serve him. Oh, we only got one to serve. That's right. And it's hard enough to obey this one. Don't you give me two more with him. <laughs> no, no. God is a God that's alone. That's right. By himself, with himself, and made everything for himself. That's right. Now, therefore. Now, therefore, fear the Lord. Fear God. And serve him. Serve him. In sincerity. With how? In sincerity. Amen. Sincerity. You know how you're serious about that girlfriend and that boyfriend? Mm -hmm. Well, your sincerity for God got to be greater than that. That's right. Some of you are so serious, you're scared to lose her, scared to lose him, and it's not your wife or your husband, but you don't mind losing God. That's right. Now, here you are, want to know where you stand with her mm -hmm. and where you stand with him. Why is it you don't want to know mm -hmm. where you stand with God? That's right. The world should want to know where do I stand with God? That's right. Am I lost or am I saved? Amen. Lord, where do I stand? Hallelujah. If you come now, where will I go? That's right. That's right. Am I right, I said? Glory to Hallelujah. God. Hallelujah. Glory Hallelujah. to God. If you come right now. Right now. Hallelujah. Do I qualify for the first resurrection or will I come in the second that have no power? That's right. Hallelujah. Will I go to heaven or to hell? That's it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lord, where do I stand? That's it. That's right. Hallelujah. 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 Glory to God. Glory to God. Mm. Hallelujah. In serving the Lord. In serving God, He wants us to serve Him without fear, yet fear Him. That's right. That's right. What do you mean, serve Him without fear? Amen. Don't fear nothing around you. Mm. And fear no one among you and don't fear Satan at all. That's right. Are you listening? Amen. 
Well, we're not going to tell you that lie like the preachers tell you. The devil don't have no power. Don't tell me he don't have no power. That's the right. The devil have plenty of power because God gave it to him. That's right. He is called the God of this world. That's right. But the only one we should fear. That's right. Is God himself. Amen. Nobody can do to you what God can. God can do. Nobody can afflict you like God can. That's right. And no one can break you like God can. And no one can bring you down like God can. That's right. That's right. Are you listening? Now therefore fear the Lord. Now therefore fear the Lord. Fear God. And serve him in sincerity. Serve him and be serious about it. And in truth. And be true in your service you give him. That's right. Mm -hmm. And put away the gods which your father served. Put away the gods, plural. Amen. The images. You see, God told you, put away gods. Put away. Put away the gods. All of you that are watching and listening, and if anybody here is trying to serve more than one, did you hear what the word of God says? And chapter verse again. Joshua chapter 24 and verse 14. What did he tell us? And put away the gods. Put away the G-O-D-S. Put your away your gods. Which put your away father. your gods. Put away the gods. <laughs> That's right. G-O-D-S. Get rid of all of them. All of them. Uh -huh. And put away the gods which your fathers served. Yes. On the other side of the flood. And, yes. And in Egypt. And serve ye the Lord. Serve who? Serve ye the Lord. All right, let's get what the word of God will do to family folk. Now in the book of St. Matthew chapter 10. And we'll start reading at verse 34. Now listen at this. Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. <laughs> no, it's a God. Do you hear it? Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. I'm, I, I, I'm not coming. Amen. Jesus said. Jesus said it. To bring peace. That's, That's right. why we preach like we do. That's right. Amen. These motivational speakers, uh, they want you to just feel good. That's right. So you can give more money. Mm -hmm. I want you to save your soul if you don't even give a dollar. That's right. Your soul outweighs money. Oh, yes. Are you listening? Oh, yes. I say your soul outweighs money. That's right. Do you hear this? Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. God said, don't even thank it. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Don't even look at Jesus this way. That's right. Like the way Hollywood made him. This <laughs> timid version. That's right. Always speaking soft and like a monk. <laughs> Amen. Scared to raise his voice. Yes. Timid. Feminine. That's right. Glory to God. That's not Jesus' way. No, no. He said, Don't think that I am that come I to send come peace on earth. To bring peace on earth. I came not to send I peace. I did not come to do what? I came not to send peace. I didn't come to bring peace. But a sword. But I come to do some damage. That's right. <laughs> That's right. I come to do damage. Amen. Glory to God, every time God sent a man, he give him the exact same sword that Jesus had. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. Jesus going to carry a, going to have a sword and going to give me a pocket knife? <laughs> no way. No way. What was the sword? His word. The word of God. Amen. And I have to use it the way he used it. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Amen. People are always so quick to say that man can dim things. He can dim things. He called names. He can dim things. I'm using the same sword. Same sword. That Jesus used. That's right. When he gave the gospel to the apostles and opened up their understanding, they did not have a different sword from the master teacher. No, no. Any man come with a different sword today, he don't represent Jesus at all. That's right. He got to have the same sword that Jesus had. That's right. What is it? Think not that I am come to send peace on don't earth. Don't think it. Don't think it at all. That's right. That I come to bring peace, peace on earth. Jesus let you know I didn't come here to get along with you. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. That's right. Glory to God. That's right. Are you getting what I'm telling you? Amen. Jesus wasn't like these other preachers. No. These other preachers come along to get along. That's right. Come to tell you things that make you feel good just to make you excited so you could run around the church like you in the Indiana 500. That's right. 
Now I'm not trying to make you run around nowhere. Amen. Amen. This thing come to make you give self inventory. That's it. Are you listening? Think not that I Make you look at yourself with a very close Bible lens. That's right. Thank God. So when God come, you'll know how you stand. That's right. And you know what got to be corrected. And you know what you got to stop. You know what you got to pull off. You know what you have to come up to. You know where you have to stop going. Go where you got to stop seeing. And where you got to stop being among. That's right. Close inventory. That's right. Whether you can stay with him, stay with her, or should you leave him, should you leave her, Go ahead, man. should you get away from them? Go ahead. What if God give you close inventory? That's right. Glory to God. That's right. I didn't come to bring peace. Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. But what? I came not to send peace, but a sword. But a sword. For I am come to set a man at variance. Listen, listen. Amen. This is what Jesus come for. That's he right. didn't just come to die for you. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> That's right. Go you ahead, know, man. a lot of folk always just focus on Jesus' death. Jesus' death. Yeah, listen, before he got to the cross, there was a lot of teaching. Yes, it was. Between birth and cross, there's a whole lot of teaching here. That's right. That many of you folk overlooking. That's right. You're just focusing on he died and show love and all that. Hey, hey, come on back. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Thank God. That's right. Eh? That's right. Don't try to rush him to no cross so quick. Oh, Come no. on back. <laughs> That's right. Go Thank ahead, God man. you got a lot of lessons he laid down here. Oh, yes. Eh? Oh, yes. Listen at this. Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. Don't you think I come to send peace on earth? I came not to send I peace. I didn't come along like everybody else. But a sword. But a sword. For I am come to set a man at variance. I come. I am come. To set a man. At variance. At odds. Against his father. Amen. <laughs> Glory to God. Amen. Whenever you bring that man, mm -hmm. what Jesus brought. Oh, yes. What did Jesus say to happen? I am come to set a man at variance. You know, when you set at variance, you set at odds. At odds. I come to set a man at variance. Against his father. Against his father. Hold it. That's right. Glory to God. Oh, yes. When the word of God come and say repent and be baptized every one of you yeah. in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sins mm -hmm. and you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost Amen. and that father been baptized father, son and Holy Ghost. He don't have the name of Jesus Christ. No. And then that son come to tell his Baptist father, right. his Methodist father, his Presbyterian father, his Catholic father, his Mormon father, right. his Jehovah Witness father. Yes. What the word of God said, he's at odds. At variance. He said at variance. I am come to set a man his father now has. Against his father. Now he come tell his father, hey, pop, you're That's not right. saved. What? That's right. What you telling me? Pop, you didn't obey Jesus. That's Jesus right. said be baptized in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. You just got Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost and the preacher didn't call the name. That's right. He make Father say him. And out of ignorance, this is how your father going to respond. I'd rather obey Jesus than obey the apostles. You fool. fool. Jesus said, to his apostles, he they hear you. Hear with me. Hear me. Hear me. You can't obey Jesus without obeying the apostles. That's right. When you obey the apostles, you obey what Jesus said. That's right. Because when Jesus died and came on back, he opened their understanding Amen. that they might understand the scriptures. That's right. Are you listening? That's right. So I'm going to set at variance. I am come to set a man at variance against his father. I'm going to set a man at variance. Against his father. Hmm. Father Baptist. That man comes say, hey, Pop, where you find the Baptist religion in the Bible? That's right. And then the father go give some type of historical background. The son say, I don't want that. That's right. I want Bible. That's right. Where the Baptist church is. That's right. I don't want that. I want Bible. That's right. Is God a Baptist? He start, he start questioning his father. That's right. 
Father may be a non-denominational preacher. Oh, yes. No specific belief. Just say he believe in Jesus. <laughs> hey, Pop, show me in the Bible mm -hmm. where Jesus was non-denominational. Well, son, I know it's not in there, but you have your religion. I have mine. Hey, Pop, I don't want that. That's right. Show me where Jesus said upon this rock, I'll build my non-denominational church. Do you hear what the Bible says? For I have come to set a man at variance. I come to set a man at odds. Against his father. Against his own daddy. That's right. Against his father. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When you see your father with that swastika. Go ahead. Go ahead. Getting together with his other bigot friends. That's right. Seeing how many black bodies he can kill. Go ahead. In Jesus' name. That's right. Ask your racist bigot father. Hey, Pop. Hey, Pop. When did Jesus come? Mm -hmm. To make a noose. To kill people of color. That's I right. read where Jesus said, God so loved the world. The world. That he gave his only begotten son That's that right. whosoever, 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 whosoever believe in him. That's right. Won't perish. That's right. But have everlasting life. Hey, Pop, give me that noose religion, that skinhead religion, yes. that swastika religion. Where is it in the Bible? Right. That's right. That a God only, Jesus only died for white folk. Only white Or folk. Jesus only died for black folk. That's right. You see how the Bible say he's going to set at variance? Set at variance. That's why they hate me, because I'm at odds That's with right. the world. That's right. I'm at odds with the whole world. Go ahead. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. The word of God said, be holy. Be holy. And if you're not holy, I'm at odds with the world religion. That's right. Preach Don't it. tell me what your father was. What do I care? That's right. If it's not holy, what he got came from hell. Oh, yes. Did you hear me? That's right. I mean, you can be a Baptist, a Methodist, a Presbyterian, a Lutheran, a non-denominational, apostolic, a Mormon, a Muslim, a Hebrew, Israelite, a Protestant, a Christian scientist, an Episcopalian. Be whatever you want. Be whatever you want. God said. That's right. Be holy. Be holy. And because God says be holy, it makes me be at odds with everything else. That's right. That's right. Yeah. For I am come to set a man at variance. I come. Amen. Oh, this is good doctrine here. Yes, it is. I come. To set a man at variance. To set a man at odds. Against his father. I'm against daddy now. That's right. I ain't buying you no cigarettes no more, Pop. That's right. Because the word of God said cleanse yourself from all filthiness of the flesh. I'm not drinking out with you no more, Father. That's right. Can't hang out at the bar no more, Pop. Oh, yes. Can't, can't swap women with you no more. That's right. Am I right? That's right. Hey, Amen. Can't go with you while you go shop to buy a toupee no more. Amen. Can't, can't help put the dye in your hair and hear you in 73. <laughs> That's right. The Bible says, honor the hoary head. That's right. Hey. Amen. What did he say? For I am come to set a man at variance. I come. Amen. Now, you that say you of God or want to be of God, but want to be on good terms with everybody, you not being realistic. No. no. You want everybody to love you and everybody to befriend you. You not being realistic. That's right. If Jesus plainly said he come to set at odds. At variance. A man set a man at variance against his father. Against his father, that means the word of God brings conflict. That's right. The word of God brings conflict in areas you think it won't bring. That's true. Amen. That's right. Are you listening? That's right. Something. Many of you get at ma get mad with me. I didn't write this. No. Thank God if I wrote this, it wouldn't be a conflict nowhere. <laughs> Amen. It'd be uh, the Rodney King syndrome. Can we all just get along? That's right. 
I did it right. Now, people all, all over social media, I mean, they cuss me out. They call me names I didn't know that Webster thought of. My Lord. All because of what's in the scriptures. That's right. I want you to hear this. I'm going to take my time and soak you. Listen Amen. good. Matthew chapter 10 and verse 35. All right. For I am come to set a man at variance against his father. Father, here you is. Mama's still alive. Mm -hmm. mm. Glory to God. <laughs> Amen. Mama's still alive, Pop. Amen. But you want me to come to your adulterous marriage. That's right. You get your second wife because you and Mama separated, but Mama didn't die yet. That's right. Son, I want you to be my, be my best man. Sorry, Pop. Sorry. No can do. I can't go for that. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Huh? That's right. Can't do it. That's right. I can't go for that. No, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> can't go for that. Oh, do no. you see that in the scripture sitting at odds? That's right. Go Son, ahead. pass me that my bottle of Jack Daniel. Oh, I can't do that, Pop. No. What you mean you can't do that? The word of God says touch not. Touch not. The word of God says handle not. That's right. Can't do that. Can't do that. Son, give me that ashtray. No, no, I can't do that. No. Mm -mm. Touch not. Touch not. Handle not. Glory to God. That's right. The head. For I have come to set a man at variance. I come to set a man at, at variance. variance. Against his father. Here's your father say, son, will you please give me my dress? I can't do that. Oh, no. No way. No way. Son, son, zip, zip, zip my dress up. <laughs> That's right. Am I right, man? Am I right, I said? That's right. Glory to God. Amen. Do you hear the Bible talking? For I am come to set a man at variance. I come. Amen. To set a man at variance. Against his father. I don't care if your father is the judge of a courthouse. That's true. When they That's stand true. before you, put your hands on the Bible. You tell them no. Oh, no. Swear not. Swear not at all. At all. At all. By things in heaven above. That's right. You tell him, I'm firm. firm. Go ahead. Go ahead. See, Go ahead. where the word of God come in, there's a conflict. So if there's a conflict, yeah. you have no business seeing me in the same places I That's used right. to go when I was a sinner. That's because right. Because there's a conflict. That's right. That's right. Any place I used to go as a sinner that's against God. Yeah. That's right. I have no business partying with you. No, no. I have no business drinking with you. No. I have no business smoking with you. No. I have no business going out on a date with you. That's right. We are at odds. There's at a variance odds. here. Variance. That's right. That's right. Many of you viewers will say, this is too extreme. Don't blame me. Blame Jesus. That's right. You are quick to say, where's your love? Here it is. Here it is. Give chapter and verse for, for, Saint, for the loving Jesus. St. Matthew chapter 10 and verse 35. Same one that died. Same one. Same one that went to the cross. That's right. Same one that offered up that body once for all. That's right. Through the eternal spirit to connect us to the everlasting life. That's right. Same one. You people focusing on the cross, the cross, the cross. Yeah. From birth to cross, there's teaching. Oh, yes. From birth to cross, between that, between that, there's teaching. That's right. That's right. So before you get to the cross, and you're <laughs> yeah. quick to say, oh, he died for all our sins. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. He also showed you what to do so you don't go to hell before he got to the cross. That's right. That's right. Do you hear it? Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. Amen. Don't Amen. even think. Give chapter and verse again, William. St. Matthew chapter 10, we're at verse 34. Don't you think I come to bring peace on earth? I came not to send peace, but a sword. I didn't come to send peace. But a sword. But a sword. For I am come to set a man at variance. I come to set a man at variance. Against his father. Against his father. And the daughter. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Amen. He didn't leave the women out neither. And the daughter against her mother. You know, the message last week 
When I was talking about marriage and relationship and from the biblical perspective, you know, I'm convinced you just can't please nobody. <laughs> Amen. There was women on social media and said, why he always got to get on the women? And then there was men on social media. He put too much emphasis on the men. My Lord. <laughs> nobody happy, Pastor. Ain't nobody happy. <laughs> nobody happy. That's right. I'm putting emphasis on the Bible. That's right. On the scriptures. That's right. Come on back. Amen. Glory to God. Come on back to God's word. That's right. You people went to churches for years and all you did was jump and play and shout and look at some robe wearing jerry curl manicured nail hypocrite all in the pulpit just amusing and entertaining you to make it feel good. That's right. We come standing flat footed and I'll pound you with God's word. That's right. And right then they say, oh, that's too strong. Too strong. What did he say? Well, I am come to set a man at variance against his father. I got the man mm -hmm. and his father. And the daughter. Now I'm going to get some more folk. And the daughter. He's uh, still setting at variance. That's right. The daughter. Against her mother. Hold it. Amen. When the word of God step in. My Lord, my Lord. If one want to obey and the other don't, mm -hmm. there's going to be a conflict between mother and daughter. And daughter. That's right. That's right. Amen. That's right. Because the mother that believed the word of God and that fear God, she going to tell her daughter the truth. Oh, yes. Amen. She see her daughter getting serious about that sinner. She going to tell him. That's right. She ain't going to just be nice. She going to tell she her the tell truth. Him. Listen, it don't need for you to get serious about him. No. He, the first thing he need to do is get ready to obey God first. Get your heart out of that relationship. That's right. She ain't going to just focus on he's nice. He's hard working. Ah, never mind that. <laughs> That's right. It's not about trying to force God on nobody. No. But it's about keeping your distance so he don't interfere with interfere. your relationship between you and God. That's right. Are you listening? That's right. What did he say? And the daughter against her mother. He's going to set it at odds. At odds. At variance. Variance. That's right. Won't agree to buy cigarettes for your mama. That's right. No more liquor for your mama. Amen. Your mama want to come stay at your house. And here's her husband still living, which is your father. Is your father. And yet she got a second man, a second husband. That's right. She want to spend the night in your house. Mm -hmm. She can spend the night, but he can't. That's right. Amen. That's you right. are not allowed to use your house as an adulterous place. Amen. You have to tell her, mama, you can stay, but he can't. He, he can't. Barney can't stay. <laughs> That's right. We don't, he don't have no money to go nowhere. Then they'll Barney go sleep in his car. Amen. Well, honey, look, that's disrespect. If he go, I go. Goodbye, mama. Goodbye, mama. I am not going to bend for you. Go I'm going to stand up for God and not bend for you or to you. That's right. Now, you viewers will call this harsh teaching, harsh. but it's in your Bible. That's right. It's in your Bible. The word of God speaks plain here. For I am come to set a man at variance against I his father. I am come. This is why Jesus came. That's right. I am come. God so loved the world. This is Jesus' love. <laughs> That's right. Laid in teaching. Laid in teaching. In the scriptures. That's right. Love is truth. Go ahead, man. Love is not because I let you do what you want. That's right. Love is truth. That's right. Tell me what's right. That's it. If I don't like it, it don't matter. Tell me what's right. That's it. Go ahead. If I cry over it, let me cry. That's right. You tell me what's right. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. Hallelujah. Go, Go ahead. ahead. Go ahead. If it break my home, Amen. Tell me what's right. That's right. If I don't speak to you in a week, you tell me what's right. That's it. Lord, thank God, if I don't speak to you in a week, let me fall on my knees and ask God, help me to overcome. That's right. That's right. Amen. That's it. You might as well, because God is not going to change. Oh, no. You churches change to accommodate the people. Right. Any church change to accommodate the people, it's a false church. A false church. 
Are you listening at what I'm saying? That's right. Any preacher change That's right. to accommodate the people, he's a false prophet. It's a false prophet. God don't change. That's right. God I, remain the same. That's right. What God say you got to do. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. 